that worked on the pile, that worked in Staten Island, where all of that toxic soup was brought, was affected. That is why we must push our federal legislators to establish permanent permanent funding for our first responders and all those who are suffering from the health effects of 9-11. We should not have to fight for reauthorization every few years. Permanent funding ensures that even 100 years down the road, anyone suffering from the effects of that horrendous attack on our nation will be able to get the help they deserve. 